now we see the example in the exercise 1.4 here <coughs> question number 2 rewrite the following statements without using if then statement okay if then statement means conditional statement without using conditional that means we want to write the equal statement without using implication okay see carefully the first question is if a man is a judge then he is honest this given statement is an implication that means if then statement the given statement it is a if then statement okay see carefully this first we write the symbolic form of this statement let p a man is judge and q a man is honest okay. therefore the symbolic form of the given statement symbolic form is it is a p implies q okay now the given statement it is a p implies q we want to write the equivalent statements to the p implies q without using implication okay we know that by the conditional law okay say carefully by the conditional law we know that it is a p implies q is equal to its equivalent statement it is a negation q implies negation p okay p implies q is equal to negation q implies negation p that means it is a law of contrapositive p implies q is equal to negation p implies negation q that means this statement is equivalent to this statement but it is also an implication and here question rewrite the sentence rewrite the statement without using if then without using if then it is also an if then now we know that the another conditional law p implies q is equal to negation p or q and now it is a disjunction sorry it is yes it is a disjunction negation p or q okay here tumhala ka question kay dela hai without using if then given statement la without using if then la mhanje tyacha equal statement lyayche the p implies q he implication hai tyacha equal statement kay the ya don equal statement hai pan tyacha he statement mhanje kay puna implication ase if then ase pan aplyala without using if then मग पी एम्प्लाइज क्यू याच्या इक्वल आणखीन दुसरं काय तर निगेशन पी ऑर क्यू हे झालं तुमचं निगेशन पी ऑर क्यू निगेशन पी ऑर क्यू हे तुमचं इम्प्लिकेशन नाही म्हणजे या स्टेटमेंटला असं लिहिता येते ओके देअर फॉर बाय कंडिशनल लॉ p implies q is equal to negation p or q therefore it is a given statement and given statement can also written as in the form of this negation p or q okay therefore the given statement given statement can also right as here p implies q is equal to negation p or q negation p a man is not judge or he is honest a man is not judge or he is honest okay here in this statement there is no if then it is or that is disjunction okay here a man is not judge or he is honest p implies q is equivalent to negation p or q okay see carefully now we see the next example second example if two is a rational number
then under root 2 is irrational number okay now here the given it is a if then statement okay the given statement it is a if then statement we want to write the given statement without using if then okay so first we can write the symbolic form the p statement 2 is a rational number okay and here root 2 is irrational number And then the symbolic form of the given statement <coughs> p implies q if p then q it is a symbolic form and we know that p implies q is equal to negation p or q here it is without using implication without using if then therefore the given statement can also written p it is negation p or q negation p means p statement it is a 2 is a rational number and negation p 2 is a not a rational number. It's a not rational liya. Kyu hua? Irrational. Doni pe ke kahi lehi le tiri chalte. It's a not rational or irrational. Therefore, the given statement here. 2 is irrational number. Or under root 2 is irrational number. Okay, here it is negation p or q, negation p or q. Rewrite the statement without using if then statement. Given statement in the if then, here this statement in the or. Okay, now next example. Again, same. Third example, if f of 2 is equal to 0, then f of x is divisible by x minus 2. Okay. Again here it is a if then statement. Here, let P statement, it is a f of 2 is equal to 0. Q statement, f of x is divisible by x minus 2. Now, here, if P then Q, the given statement is an implication. We want to write the given statement without using implication. Now here, if p then q, if p then q, therefore it is a symbolic form of the given statement, it is a p implies q and by conditional law, by law of the implication, we know that p implies q is equal to negation p or q, therefore this given statement can also written in the form negation p or q and therefore here, negation p f of 2 is not equal to 0. P statement f of 2 equal to 0. Negation P f of 2 not equal to 0 or f of x is divisible by x minus 2. Here it is a or that means this statement rewrite the statement without using if then here that is if then nahi mhanje tumhala implication ch statement delile ani lihayla ka sangitle without using implication carefully paha tini example exam madi yachatla je khada question yel kiwa dusra konta hi if then cha konta hi question yel the if then symbolic form lehayacha adi p implies q ani tya symbolic form la ya form madi lihnar p implies q is equal to negation p or q 
ओके टेक्स्ट बुक मध्य एक्जाम्पल्स है नहीं तो एखाद दुसर एक्जाम्पल को ही हो सकते इफ देन चोके मैं इफ देन आधी सीम्बॉलिक फॉर्म ये जला सीम्बॉलिक सीम्बॉलिक फॉर्म आनतर पी एम्प्लाइज क्यू इज इक्वल टू निगेशन पी और क्यू मग पी आ क्यू तेज लिखना निगेशन पी और क्यू हिर ओके इट इज अ ऑर विदाउट यूजिंग इफ देन केयरफुली पहा 